I never really got too far, though. Well, I don't really think I know enough to make my own game. Maybe you could teach me about different types of games? Of course, I'd be happy to. Okay, well, what's this one over here? That's the Pocket Monster series. For in... in... Uh, that's the Pocket Monster series for Nintendo. You control and train cute monsters to be the very best. Gotta catch them all. Okay, and this one? That's Fantasy Last, an RPG series with different stories. And turn-based battles. Okay, what about those figures over here? Oh, that's how they bring more money out of you. I mean, oh, those are the new figures by Nintendo. They work with all kinds of different Nintendo games. They work in the game? How? Well, each figure has a chip inside. You touch it to the controller, and depending on the game, something will happen. For example, for Super Nintendo Brawl, you can use them as characters on your team to fight online with. Wow, that's fun! If you use them with Fire Shield, you can gain new units for your army and new weapons for them to use. Huh, who knew? Some of these characters are cute. What game does this figure work with? Oh, that one is for Fire Shield, too. Fire Shield, huh? It's an army game? Kinda, but it's set in a fantasy world with dragons and magic. You raise an army and train them in order to defeat the evil lords trying to rule the world? You can even date characters in the army and have children. Then the children can join the army too. Wow, okay, that sounds like fun. You get the whole family on in on the, you know, murder and whatnot. Is there a lot of story? Um, yes, it's about political struggles in the world they live. There are also a lot of side stories for characters' relationships. Would you like to try it? Yeah, that sounds great. Can I borrow the figures too? Of course, they are all... Mm, of course, they are owned by the club, so please feel free. Thank you. The lies. Have you ever made a game? Um, I could, but no one ever wanted to make one with me. I'm not good at coming up with artwork or stories. Well, I'll draw a character one day. Maybe that will help you? Um, I'd like that. Thank you, Ami. Looks like I'm... Let's try that again. Looks like I'm now a fully-fledged member of the Coding Club. Da -da -da -da. I'm really excited to try this Fire Shield game. Alright, well, I'm going to take off a little early and play this at home. We'll meet again later this week. Um, I'm here every day, so please come by anytime. Every day? Don't you have other friends or things to do? It's kind of complicated. But no, I'm okay spending my time here. She sounded so sad for a second. I think that was supposed to be Liza's line, but it switched back to Amy. Oh well. Well, I'm... Mm. Well, I'd better not probe any further. Well, thanks, Liza. You're the best. See you later. Kind of weird that Liza spends all her time at the club. She did say it was complicated, though. Maybe your parents work out of the country, too? No sense in worrying about it. I have a game to play. Screw real people. Time to go to the digital world. Fire shield, huh? Oh, I can create an avatar. That's a nice touch. Oh, and that's King Kronos? He's one of the figures I have. Let's see. Yep. Let me tap my 
Nintendo figure to my PS Vita. Okay, I unlocked a new armor set. That's going to help, I think. There sure is a lot of dialogue. I don't expect that from this kind of game. I'm not complaining, though. It's a good thing. I think I could really get into this. Better head to bed, though. Avoid a, re avoid a repeat of this morning. Hey, did you hear what happened in gym class? You know... What? You know, Marika, right? Duh, who doesn't? Toughest girl in school! She picked a fight with Laura in the locker room. No way, what happened? While Marika was picking on Julie, she'd stolen her underwear. Saying stuff like, I thought Dykes didn't wear underwear. Well, <laughs> lol, okay, and then? Well, then Laura came over being all, like, protective and everything. So they're for real dating. I know, right? But anyway, Laura swings at Marika and they start having a fight right there. No way! Right? I mean, it was broken out quickly. Hey, you hear those girls talking again? Let's do that again. Hey, you hear what those girls are talking about? Huh? Oh, yeah. It's crazy when stuff like that happens. I guess. I try and avoid them when I can. They picked on you before? Not for a long time, but having red hair will do that. What a stupid reason to pick on someone. I know, just because they like each other. Well, I meant more the red hair thing, but I'm um, sure, that too. D anyway, lunch on the roof? Sure. Teenagers are assholes because they learn to be assholes from their parents. Everyone is assholes. So, you have your eye on anyone right now? Huh? We go to an all-girls school and I talk to you and one other person. What the fuck are you going on about, right? Well, all that Julie and Laura stuff got me thinking. You have your eye on anyone? No, I mean... I know, all girls' schools suck, right? Right. But you've always got to have an angle to meet a boy from another school. Gotta find the most interesting thing about you and just make sure they know about it. What if I don't want to be interesting to boys? I mean, I'm just not interested in dating right now. What's the saying? I don't need a boyfriend, I need 12 million dollars and a donut? I want 12 million dollars and a donut. I guess, but don't you get lonely? Oh, sometimes. Again, I think Ray is supposed to be saying it, but it still says Ami above it. Such a great update this was. See, maybe you should consider it. I guess. This is so awkward. I mean, Ray's cute as hell. I'd date her given half a chance. Actually, are you looking for anyone right now? Well, no, not right now. All the boys I know are kinda dumb. Teenage boys, of course they're dumb. Like the kid who works part-time at my parents' store? So stupid, just talks about baseball all day. But you're cute. It shouldn't be hard to find a date. St I mean, st stupid. I could get one if I wanted. I just haven't found anyone good enough, that's all. No one will ever live up to my high standards. 
Alright. Well, let's eat, shall we? I do enjoy teasing her sometimes. It does make it hard to be honest with her, though. I don't know, mommy. I mean... I get where you're coming from, and for a lot of people, especially their school years, it is not a great time to come out. But I was out in my school years, but that's because most people didn't know me, and I didn't care. Hey, Lies, do you want to make a game? Huh? What's this all of a sudden? Well, I was really enjoying Fire Shield and thought it would be fun to draw characters and artwork for a game. I didn't know a game like Fire Shield is probably hard, but what other type of games could we make? Um, well, platformers are a good place to start. <coughs> oh. Alright, hang on. Ray's voice takes it really out of me for some reason, even though none of my voices are really all that different. I just can't handle the high sundariness. Well, we could make it about timing and jumping, which is pretty much what most platformers are. Or we could make it about fighting M... <laughs> or we can make it about finding enemies as you reach the goal. I like the second one. Well, what about something where you're a ninja? Fighting to rescue your pet at the end of the level. Well, okay, um... What would the pet be? Well, let's say it was a cat. Yeah. Wow, this version goes much faster. <laughs> Cats are cute, okay, that works. But, um, what about the ninja? What about the ninja? Well, if you just create a regular ninja, no one will be interested. Oh, I see your point. Well, what if the ninja was a cat, too? Cat ninja. Yeah, she could be a cat girl who is a ninja, saving her cat family, from the evil Diamond Dog Clan. Dog? Diamond Dog Clan. What? Wow, you're really good at this, Ami. Or am I? I was getting a little carried away there. It's a stupid idea. No, I like it. I think it's a great idea. Really? You mean that? Uh-huh, um... Let me show you how we can make it. I have a program called MK Script that's really good at these types of games. Okay. So you think you can draw the characters? Yeah, let me work on the main character at home tonight. This is going to be great, Lies. Yeah. We worked for the next hour or so and didn't really talk much. Lies really is quiet. I wonder if she's... Uh, Lies really is quiet. I wonder if it's just me or if she is like this all the time. I kind of like hanging out with her, though. And she's really hot. I mean, she kind of stands out that way. <clears throat> Burps. Maybe I should ask her something. Try and break the ice. Um... Wow, so many choices. <laughs> so I know this game has multiple endings, but I haven't really decided who we're going to go after yet. You know what, let's go after Ray. So we don't need to know that much about lies. No, I don't want to ruin the mood. Another time, maybe. Oh, was that last bit too loud? I, I don't know when I'm talking to people or talking in my head. I agree. See you. That well, Again, awesome update. Hey, Ami. Busy? No, what's up? Someone at school was telling me 
about this new web flick show? Tangerine Black or something? About a regular woman who goes to jail? Wanna watch it with me? Is that supposed to be Orange is the New Black? And if we're going after Ray, then usually by visual novel standards, that means spending the most amount of fucking time you can with. Yeah. Sure, we can do that. I'll be over in ten. It will do me some good to be more social. It will do me some good to be more social, after all. And then to Ray's room, which is my old room. Hey, popcorn. Sure. So you said this was about a women's jail? Yeah, it's this woman who was sent to jail for a really old crime. She's kind of a regular person with a good job, so it's weird. It's supposed to be really funny, though. Okay, well, I'm excited. So, what did you think of the movie we apparently just watched? Or show? It's okay, but did there have to be so much? Wait, the nudity is what you had a problem with? I just didn't expect it is all I mean. I guess if you're in a woman's prison. Only only sexy things will be other women, I guess. Kinda like being at an all-girls school. Huh? No way! Totally different! <laughs> it's so easy to make you embarrassed. Shut up already! Oh, that's right. I said I'd draw the character for the game tonight. But remember what Lia said, she has to be unique. So, let's give her blue, 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 blue hair. Let's give her blue hair. Yeah. And then give her a really good, cool sword that glows blue in the dark. Right? Next, her outfit should be totally ninja and practical, unlike most anime ninjas whose outfits aren't really practical and have your boobs out front. But she should totally look badass, so boobs out front? As opposed to out back? What am I saying? Oh man, this is gonna be great. At this rate, I'll have something great to show Lies tomorrow. I wonder if she can use this though. I don't know exactly what she needs. I hope it's good enough. I mean, she didn't really discuss that you have to make so many graphics for everything. Hi, Ami. What are you doing? Just finishing off. The physics engine, want to see? Whoa, you've got so much done already? Why is your genius? Um, not really. Yeah, you are. This is crazy for one day. It's not that hard when you have a lot of templates. Why don't you show me how much you've done? Sure! So, what do you think? Hmm. It's a great character. She's really good. Where did you learn to draw like that? Oh, I draw a lot at home. She's still rough and not totally covered in. That's okay. I'll need some pictures that I can turn into animations. Is that okay? Well, I've really never done any. I'm not sure. Here. One like this, like this, and like this. I can turn that into a running animation. Think you can do it? Yeah, I can do that. Just, it's, 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 I'm being flustered around you, you, um, Lias, I'm sorry. Yeah, I can do that. It's just more drawing, right? Mm-hmm, that's it. I'm so glad you liked her. She is so cool. Hey. Do you think we could make a figure for it, too? Like the ones for Fire Shield? How do those work, anyway? Mmm, they use radio chips. The chips are in the base of the figure. I could build a 3D model of the character and then use the school's 3D 
printer to print the mo If you're gonna build a 3D model of the character, why don't you make graphics yourself? That, that, that's an artistic talent. What? Then all we need is to program the chip and put it inside and then paint the figure. Does the character have a name? Yep, Starla. I thought it was cute. I like it. I'll put it on the base. Because this is totally how making a game works and whatnot. Wow, you really work fast, huh? This will take some time. We can work on the game, though. Okay, well, I'll get to work. I sat down and started drawing. And drawing. And drawing. This is actually quite a lot of work. It is fun, though, and I don't like hanging out here. It kind of feels like I fit in here, even if only a little bit. At least I fit in somewhere. I feel ya. I feel ya, Ami.